Hey everyone, Thursday, October 15th here with your day trading update. Uh, green day today, plus $392. Was up close to a thousand uh, when we left the live stream, but gave a little bit back, unfortunately, in the late morning. Uh, had a pairs trade in gold, silver, uh, net, net, uh, minus 436. So actually my, my first losing pairs trade in a while, in a couple weeks or since last week, I should say. I uh, had a little runner in the NASDAQ for 85 bucks, little runner in Boeing for 80, little runner scratch basically and beyond for 20 bucks. Couple of nice mighty 90 trades in Netflix and then one losing runner in Netflix, but net net 219 on the day. My biggest loser was Neo. I jumped in this as a an upside runner uh, after we left the live stream and that uh, just kind of chopped me up. Uh, Peloton, my biggest winner, plus 530, nice runner. Tesla, 290. And Zoom, plus 395. So net net uh, on the day, plus $392. When we left the live stream room, I, one of my last comments was, well, we could have a four-figure day for the third day in a row. And that right there, I knew as soon as it came out of my mouth, was the kiss of death. Uh, I knew from that point on I was going to lose, give some of that money back. So unfortunately, not another four-figure day today, but still green nonetheless. So let's go over these, uh, starting with uh, the NASDAQ. So we had a the, – the stock started off really strong and then and flushed down. NASDAQ was at its lows for the day. I was looking for a point to get short because I thought this was going to roll over. I almost did there, but I held off. Uh, which was a good move. It did push higher and I got short and I caught some of this here. It, I, I was waiting for more and gave some back on this bounce, but still uh, a little bit of a winner in uh, in the NASDAQ. AMD, this one was a little frustrating as I had a really nice winner going. Um, when price pushed down here, started to consolidate. Actually, let me get to the right day here. Get to today. So we had this we had this big push lower down through the lows of the day, started consolidating right at this pivot, right under yesterday's lows. And so we got short here, caught this nice move down. Uh, I was looking, the market started getting really weak. I was looking for lower prices. And so as it bounced, I started adding back in and then ended up just getting flushed out. I caught a little bit more of this move here, but ended up being a loser overall because uh, I started to get a little bit bigger in size than I had started with, so ended up giving it back. Uh, so net net, two hundred nine dollar loser in AMD. In Boeing, I took a small win, eighty bucks. Beyond was basically a scratch, just trying to catch a downside runner. Beyond uh, ended up just making twenty bucks. Netflix was a uh, a great trading vehicle today. Uh, caught a couple winners, so we had this initial push up. We got short right here and caught a piece of this. And then as it pushed lower, 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 we got sh we we went ahead and got long here, and then long here as well, and then caught this bounce. So caught two winners right in a row, uh, and then I tried to catch a a downside runner in Netflix. I think it was about right here, and ended up getting flushed out. I got flushed out right at the top, right before it turned, uh, which would have been in my favor. So that would have been three winning trades in Netflix, but two out of three ain't bad. So winner in Netflix. So Neo. This is one that was uh, a little frustrating. Uh, let me get this junk off. So Neo uh, opened up really strong today, above yesterday's high, really positive, and started consolidating here. I was looking for a continuation. Unfortunately, got flushed out. So that was my biggest loss. Took uh, because I was uh, I got long about right here and added to it right here, uh, started to work in my favor. I thought we were off to the races to the upside and then just got hammered. So they ended up taking my uh, biggest loss there. Peloton, what a what a great upside runner this thing has been. Um, we, took, uh, we took this in the room where we got long. I think it was, yeah, started getting long right here, added a little bit more here on this pullback, and I ran this thing all the way up to the pivot. Did leave a little bit on the table by not holding it longer, but still just a great trade. Plus 530. Uh, Tesla. Uh, in Tesla, we did a, a mighty 90 and booked 280 bucks. Uh, let's see. Tesla. Oh, yeah. So 
on this flush down, we got long right here and caught this bounce for a nice quick $280. I ended up trying to take a runner in Tesla later in the day and ended up just scratching it for like minus 10 bucks, but um, net net plus 290 in Tesla. And then lastly, Zoom caught another nice runner in Zoom to the upside. And this is the cool thing about this is, you know, the market was pretty bearish all day and we caught a lot of a lot of winners to the upside. Um, and that just speaks to the to the strategy. So it was Zoom uh, came up. We got long here, had a, took a little bit of heat and then finally it broke through uh, and I I got out all of my whole position right here. It did end up pulling back. I actually tried to get filled here for another bounce, did not get filled. And sure enough, it was a nice winner back up to that pivot. So uh, booked 395 on that one. Could have been more had I gotten filled, but uh, that's okay. So plus 392 on the day. Uh, tomorrow is Friday. We'll be in the live stream room starting at 8.30 a.m. Central. Look forward to seeing you then. If you guys have any questions, let me know.